Step into the nostalgic halls of Bayside High School, where the iconic 1989 TV series Saved by the Bell unfolded the trials and triumphs of a group of friends navigating the maze of adolescence. A cultural touchstone for many, this series has etched its mark on the landscape of television, leaving an indelible legacy that resonates even today. As we explore some random facts about the show, take a moment to ponder. Can you recall a personal story of how Saved by the Bell has influenced your life? Or perhaps, is there a cherished memory entwined with this classic series? Now, let's dive into some intriguing tidbits about the show. Did you know that Saved by the Bell was originally conceived as a vehicle for educational content? The series aimed to seamlessly blend entertainment with moral lessons, making it a unique addition to the Saturday morning lineup. The charismatic Zach Morris, portrayed by Mark Paul Dasselar, wasn't just a fictional heartthrob. He also broke the fourth wall, addressing the audience directly in a quirky narrative style. Despite its sunny portrayal of high school life, the behind-the-scenes dynamics were not always harmonious. The cast faced challenges and conflicts, giving depth to the seemingly carefree world of Bayside. As the show progressed through its various iterations, including Good Morning, Miss Bliss, and Saved by the Bell, the college years, it continued to capture the hearts of viewers across generations. Prompt for engagement, now it's your turn. What's your most cherished memory or personal experience related to Saved by the Bell? We'd love to hear your stories and reflections in the comments below. Share the impact this series had on your life or a special moment you associate with the adventures of Zack, Kelly, Slater, Jesse, Lisa, and Screech. As we unravel the layers of Saved by the Bell, it's clear that this show transcends its temporal origins, leaving an enduring imprint on the fabric of television history. So, what's your story? Drop it in the comments below, and let's continue the conversation about this iconic series that continues to echo through the corridors of memory. Saved by the Bell, a beloved TV series that debuted in 1989, emerged from the success of its predecessor, Good Morning, Miss Bliss. Originally set in an Indiana junior high school, the show underwent a creative shift, relocating to the sunny halls of Bayside High in California. This shift not only introduced a new setting but also refined the ensemble cast, featuring the charismatic Zach Morris, the charming Kelly Kapowski, the nerdy but endearing Samuel Screech Powers, the jock AC, Slater, the fashionable Lisa Turtle, and the brainy Jesse Spano. The series carved its niche by skillfully blending humor, teenage drama, and moral lessons, navigating the challenges of adolescence with wit and heart. Zach Morris, portrayed by Mark Paul Dasselar, served as the quintessential charming troublemaker, known for his break-the-fourth-wall moments. The iconic Max, the Bayside diner owner, added an extra layer of quirkiness to the show. Saved by the Bell became a cultural phenomenon, influencing fashion trends and teenage vernacular of the early 90s seconds. Its impact on popular culture is evident in the enduring popularity of catchphrases like Time Out and the lasting affection for its characters. Beyond the small screen, the show spawned spin-offs, TV movies, and a revival showcasing its enduring legacy in the world of television. The series remains a nostalgic touchstone for those who grew up in the 90 seconds, an emblematic representation of a bygone era of Saturday morning television. Its timeless lessons, memorable characters, and lighthearted charm continue to resonate with new generations, making Saved by the Bell an enduring classic in the annals of television history. In Principal Belding's office, the photos on the wall hold more than just fictional significance. They feature real snapshots of Dennis Haskins' family, showcasing a personal touch within the set. This subtle detail adds a layer of authenticity to the Bayside High School setting. Amidst the on-screen friendships, off-screen dynamics often differ. Mark Paul Gosselar and Dustin Diamond, who portrayed best friends on the show, didn't share a close relationship outside of work. Notably, Gosselar expressed kind words on social media following Diamond's passing a contrast to the silence from most other cast members. While Kelly and Zack's on-screen romance was central, behind the scenes, Lark Voorhees, who played Lisa Turtle, was romantically involved with Mark Paul Dasselar for three years. This off-screen connection adds an intriguing layer to the dynamics of the cast, extending beyond the scripted narrative. These behind-the-scenes glimpses provide a unique perspective on the making of Saved by the Bell, showcasing the blend of real-life connections and the carefully crafted world within the iconic TV series. 
Mark Paul Gosselaar's off-screen romantic entanglements added a layer of drama behind the scenes of Saved by the Bell. Throughout the series, he dated all three of his female co-stars Elizabeth Berkley, Lark Voorhees, and Tiffany Thiessen. This led to tension among the actresses, reaching a point where the executive producer had to intervene and mediate discussions. There were instances when Lark, Elizabeth, and Tiffany weren't on speaking terms, creating a dynamic off-screen that contrasted with the on-screen camaraderie. This behind-the-scenes drama sheds light on the complexities of maintaining professional relationships amid personal entanglements in the world of television. Research conducted by NBC after the show had been on television for around four weeks revealed a surprising statistic. 50% of teenage girls in the United States were watching the 1989 TV series Saved by the Bell. This unexpected popularity catapulted the show into the spotlight and cemented its status as a cultural phenomenon. Originating as Good Morning, Miss Bliss, said in an Indiana junior high school, the show underwent a significant transformation, relocating to the sunny halls of Bayside High in California. This shift not only changed the setting but also refined the ensemble cast, featuring characters like the charismatic Zach Morris, the charming Kelly Kapowski, the nerdy but endearing Samuel Screech Powers, the jock AC, Slater, the fashionable Lisa Turtle, and the brainy Jesse Spano. The move to California and the removal of several characters sparked a fan theory that the entire show might be an elaborate daydream by Zach Morris, who fantasizes about being a cool kid that always succeeds. Supporters point to the show's theme song, supposedly describing Zach's thoughts and his ability to do a timeout, where he temporarily stops time and breaks the fourth wall. Saved by the Bell's success not only influenced fashion trends and teenage vernacular in the early 90 seconds, but also became a nostalgic touchstone for those who grew up during that era. Its enduring legacy is evident in spin-offs, TV movies, and a revival showcasing its lasting impact on the world of television. In the world of Bayside High, where real snapshots of Dennis Haskins' family adorned Principal Belding's office, the show's on-screen friendships often diverged from off-screen dynamics. Mark Paul Gosselaar's off-screen romantic entanglements added a layer of drama as he dated all three of his female co-stars Elizabeth Berkley, Lark Voorhees, and Tiffany Thiessen, leading to tension among the actresses. These behind-the-scenes glimpses provide a unique perspective on the making of Saved by the Bell, showcasing the blend of real-life connections and the carefully crafted world within the iconic TV series. The unexpected viewership among teenage girls and the show's journey from Indiana to California mark just a fraction of the intriguing aspects that contribute to the show's enduring legacy. As we bid farewell to the neon-soaked halls of Bayside High, it's impossible not to feel a surge of nostalgia for the bygone era when Zach Morris ruled the school with his brick-sized cell phone and Kelly Kapowska's charm melted hearts faster than Mr. Belding could say hey. Hey, hey, what is going on here? Saved by the Bell wasn't just a show, it was a cultural touchstone that etched itself into the collective memory of a generation. As you reflect on the escapades of Zack, Kelly, Slater, Jesse, Lisa, and Screech, consider the subtle yet profound impact this 1989 gem had on shaping your own teenage odyssey. Did you find solace in the timeless lessons of friendship and love? Perhaps you were inspired by the unapologetic quirkiness of Screech or the tenacity of Jesse. Whether it was the infectious camaraderie or the relatable struggles, Saved by the Bell became more than a show. It became a mirror reflecting our own awkward, hilarious, and heartwarming moments. Now, it's your turn to share. What are your cherished memories from the Bayside Crew's antics? Did you have a favorite character, a memorable episode, or a life lesson that stuck with you? We'd love to hear your thoughts and reminisce together about the golden age of high school sitcoms. As we navigate the corridors of memory, remember that Saved by the Bell isn't just a show frozen in the 90 seconds. It's a timeless testament to the enduring spirit of friendship and self-discovery. So, take a moment to dive into your mental yearbook, unlock those nostalgia chambers, and share your reflections. Let's celebrate the magic that continues to make Saved by the Bell an unforgettable journey through the halls of adolescence. Thank you for joining us on this trip down memory lane, and for sharing your thoughts on this iconic series. Your time and nostalgia are greatly appreciated.